Hi, this is Ron from High Tech Legion and this is a Zotac GeForce GTX 560Ti Amp Edition video card. Like all GTX 560Ti video cards, it has a standard 1GB of GDDR5 memory on a 256-bit memory interface. But what makes this an Amp Edition video card is the factory overclock of 950MHz on the core from the default 822. The memory also has been overclocked from 2002 MHz to 2200 MHz. As you can see from the front cover, it features the artwork from Ubisoft's Assassin's Creed Brotherhood in the front. This is a standalone game, a sequel of sorts to the Assassin's Creed 2 video game came out a few years ago. But uh, the PC version is due to come out on the US market uh, on March the 22nd and for the UK market on March the 18th. All Zotac GeForce GTX 560Ti App Edition video cards come with a standard 2-year warranty. But if you register your video card serial number found in the lower right hand corner, you will get an extended limited lifetime warranty. On the side of the box, there is also the specifications listed. At the back, there are some promotional information. And at the other side, there is a system requirements listed at the bottom. Now let's take a look at what is inside this box. The cover box opens on the left hand side. Simply lift the flap and we can see already that there is the got the Assassin's Creed key code and the installation CD including a, a sticker for your Zotac. Uh, maybe you can put it on your case. And uh, this installation CD includes the graphics card drivers the uh, Premium Boost Zotac software and the user's manual. Also, we can see that we, uh, this is a, a, a promotional product sheet for the, what is, uh, what is in the Zotac Boost Premium software package. And this is the warranty information and quick installation guide. It's a quick run through. It is written in, also in multiple languages. See, we have German, French, Korean, Polish, so should be covered. And this is a more user's manual. So that was just an installation guide. This is, uh, I guess, the more detailed uh, manual. And we have, of course, the card itself. Let's first check out the uh, accessories. We have this is a VGA to DVI uh, converter. We have two of these uh, four pin Molex, two six pin uh, adapters for your power supply. And also we have this, uh, what looks like a mini display port, um, I mean rather a mini HDMI to HDMI converter. Aside from the overclocked core and memory of the Zotac GTX 560Ti Amp Edition video card, there are also minor physical differences. For example, if you look closely in the shroud, the Zotac GTX 560Ti Amp Edition has perforations in the yellow areas so that air can exhaust out. And at the front, unlike the normal GTX 560Ti, it doesn't have a tapered top, but is completely open. There is a single 80mm fan blowing cool air down the 3 heat pipe copper base. Aside from the active fan and the copper heatsink cooling the core, there is also a solid base plate that passively cools the PCB components including the VRAM. In order to achieve high stable overclocks on the AMP Edition video cards, Zotac handpicked the chips, used aluminum electrolytic capacitors, and used PCBs which have 2 to 4 more layers than the standard solution. To use the Zotac GTX 560Ti AMP Edition video card, the user must connect a pair of 6-pin PCIe connectors on a minimum 500 watt or greater power supply. There is a single SLI connector in the rear for up to two video cards. The top row of the rear bracket is dedicated exclusively to exhausting hot air, while below that is an HDMI port and a pair of DVI ports. 